basil's tasty. This basil's really good. <laughs> it's, 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 it's the best it's basil good. you've ever eaten. Gotham Green CEO Viraj Puri knows his basil, lettuce, and tomatoes. He also knows New York City has plenty of space to grow them, not on the ground, but on roofs. One vastly underutilized resource we do have is unused rooftop space. We started to look up on the rooftops. There certainly was some trepidation on the parts of some building owners, but a lot of them also thought it was a pretty compelling idea. The idea, now a reality, is building commercial-scale pesticide-free greenhouses on roofs. This 20,000 square foot rooftop farm grows food hydroponically 365 days a year thanks to proprietary technology. We have a weather station outside that has uh, temperature, humidity, CO2, wind direction, wind speed, solar radiation. If it gets too hot or too cold, fans, heaters, shades and vents kick in to keep conditions at an ideal 65 to 75 degrees. A controlled environment capable of getting food to consumers faster and fresher than a conventional farm. If I pick it today, how quickly does it get on the shelves? Oftentimes, product that you will find in the supermarket would be harvested that same day. The company built its second greenhouse on the roof of Brooklyn's first Whole Foods Market, one of its more than 50 retail customers across New York. We're growing bok choy, green leaf lettuce, red leaf lettuce, arugula. Gotham Greens raised $15 million from investors to get its business off the ground. So far, it's reaping impressive returns. You're profitable today. Since day one, essentially, we've been uh, profitable. This year, we'll probably do over 100% growth in revenue, and next year, probably about 300% forecasted. This farm will probably yield almost 20 times the yield per unit area compared to a conventional farm. Yields more, but Pori says it probably costs a lot more than conventional farming. We're not trying to say this is the best way to do it or this is the future of farming. Does it have a role to play? Absolutely. We're disrupting the conventional supply chain. We're growing extremely high quality product in close proximity to large urban marketplaces. It's definitely an entrepreneurial adventure, but at the same time, at the heart of it, we are farmers. Uh, we're urban farmers.